I was reading that book when I was on bed rest. I was pregnant with twins, and I, I was reading this book of letters between Bishop and Lowell, and I was so captivated and couldn't, couldn't put it down. And I thought, why am I so captivated? It's not narrative. But there was something deeply compelling about the way these two lives intersected, and I so deeply wanted to know how it all came out and what happened. But also I was so moved by these two poets who are two of the greatest writers we've ever seen, um, you know, in the last century, and the way they put almost their entire lives into language for the other, and how they wrote sort of their best selves for the other, and also how it was really a love story, um, but not in the way we think of love stories. I mean, she was a lesbian, he was with a variety of women, but they really loved each other and on some level I think were soulmates, but it's a love story. And I think in its most simple sense, it's a story of friendship. And I think I don't see enough stories about friends because I think it's a, not a narrative structure. But friendship is sort of enduring and strange and goes through ups and downs. And um, I, I found that so moving that their friendship was so present to them always, but they weren't always in the same place or they were rarely in the same place. Mm -hmm.